I've opened a blank DaVinci Resolve project, and uh, we're actually going to use uh, the colors, the color tools in here to create this color space transform and then save it out as a 3D LUT for our camera. I just took a sample shot of uh, Bob the head on a stick over there, and uh, I can look through here and it says input color space, but this tells me black magic design film gen one. Now we want to go directly to the color tab. And if you go over to uh, this open FX panel, and if it's not visible, just click it, then you can search for color space transform. Drag that onto the node that you have here. Set the input color space to whatever the footage was in. In this case, it was here, Blackmagic Design Film Gen 1. And then the input gamma should just be the uh, default one. So I think it's Blackmagic Design Film. Now, let's pick an output color space. And we said we wanted Rec. 709, right? So let's go in and uh, scroll down to Rec. 709. And same thing over here. Uh, Rec. 709. I believe if you use Gamma 2.4, it would be the same thing. I think they're equivalent. And then uh, turn tone mapping off. We we don't want DaVinci Resolve to do any tone mapping. Ma you do want to make sure these are unchecked. These apply OOTFs. Is once we're happy with this color space transform, is go over here and right click it, and then you can see generate LUT. Now for my camera, my camera accepts a 33 point cube, so that's what I'm going to click. And then I'll just save this to my downloads folder and I'm going to call this uh, Black Magic Design Film Gen 1 to Rec 709. Save. 